Ah! Too loud. I think that's good. What's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of this series. Um, let's play Casual Emerald. Um, in the last episode, we went ahead and fought every... Well, not really every single trainer. We fought, like, majority of the trainers. We really haven't fought the, uh... The Cycling Road yet. We haven't fought Wally yet. We haven't fought the Winstray family yet. We haven't did anything regarding the... Trick house. So in today's episode, guys, we are going to go ahead and we're going to go on to the cycling road because why not? Might as well get some more experience. Train arc for everyone. Or this might just be just dub the trick master's house. So hey, here we go, everyone. Let's do this. I just did a hop and I didn't really want to. It's been a while since I last recorded and there's a psychic down here. She literally broke the rules. You're, you're not supposed to be down here unless you have a bike. Jacqueline! What the hell, man? You're like disobeying like the laws of life. Okay, failure. Alright, dead. Okay, that was that was relatively easy. Alrighty. I wondrously lost. You sure did. So, uh... Well, yeah, I forgot you evolved last episode. Um... Let's switch Kippen. I mean, Kip's gonna get a lot of screen time in the next episode. But, uh, I don't know. I think I remember a lot of people here having Magnemites. For some reason. Um... Here we go. Yep, yeah, apparently all the- apparently every single trainer on this route has Magnemite, so... And the only person we can destroy Magnemite with is, you guessed it, Kip. So basically, yeah. That's- that's basically it. Hey. Oh, that was a hard too. I mean, I guess, you know, I like you. Let's have a rematch on Cycling Road. Uh... You said you like me. No girl has ever... No, I'm kidding. There's some girls that said they like me. Yo, you can keep them... I mean, I can try. I'm not no uh, triathlete like you. But, uh, I mean, I'm a Pokemon god. Not really. I relatively suck at Pokemon. One of these days, I'm going to try to do a flawless Nuzlocke. I mean... I think, apparently, Marilyn did it or something. He, like, did a Pokemon Gold, Silver, Crystal stream. And he didn't lose any Pokemon. So the question is, how? Because every nuts like I do, I lose so many Pokemon. I really get pissed. Especially in my nuts lock series, uh, well, I don't get, like, really pissed, I'm just like, well, fuck, here goes, like, 50 minutes of grinding for, like, any Pokemon I lose, uh, which happens quite a bit in my, uh, Sacred Gold series, um, which, by the way, um, that's soon gonna be, uh, coming back, the second, uh, Crystal Clear's done, I'm still gonna try to do some, uh, Fire Emblem, I have a lot of time right now because uh, my parents are are uh, coming for the house for like the next like day or two. Hopefully they're gone all tomorrow too, so I have more time to record and do all that shit. My thighs are like rocks. So recently I, I actually, me and my brother, we um we went back to my old hometown. In the same time I recorded that episode where I'm like. Shitting on my old town, I'm just like, I'll be happy if I never went back there again. Legit, two days later, I'm back down there again. And I don't have any internet, which kind of sucks. This was like a few weeks ago. Like, two weeks ago? So, I'm back down there. We have no internet. Kind of broke a couple isolation rules, but you know, the, 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 the laws and... People in my own hometown, they don't give a fuck. And if anyone had corona down in... Down there, we would all know. And also, it's relatively boring now. Though. So we just like hung around with our friends. We got like takeout. Also, I had takeout last Friday, which was pretty good. 
and um, we have a mountain bikes which we have had since uh, since like since like 2015. Oh, I hate muscle cramps. Thank you. But uh, we got our bikes uh, back home right now. And uh, every so often, me and my brother, we go for uh, like 20 to 30 minute bike rides. We went like, I think four or five. No, we went like three actually. So far. And let's just say, whoa. They, they definitely take a lot out of me because I haven't been really like, been active these past few years because like, you know, college and I have work and now I'm just, I have nothing to do right now, so. And the and it's like summer it's like summer weather right now. It's uh June, so weather's like really fucking nice. So we just go for like bike rides every so often, just like you know have fun, you know, just get a bit of exercise. My dad's been starting doing some bike rides too. It's pretty good for him. Kip, you legit just gained like an entire like two levels from this place. Your brakes fail. Oh, that's not good. My bike's like pretty much mint. Oh, that's it. On the side of the road, those riding mock bikes are rated for the number of collisions and their total times. Acro bikes do not qualify for rating. They're easy to turn, so it's not fair. I wonder what, what happens if you actually like 100% that challenge, like make it on the record time without being collisions or whatnot. I don't know. So anyway, guys, um, we're gonna go up ahead and enter this place. You're being watched. I wonder where. Huh? Urgh. How'd you know I concealed myself beneath this desk? You're sharp. I forget if I did this in my other Emerald Nuzlocke playthroughs, but um, I probably did, actually. Behold, for I'm the greatest living mystery of a, of a man all hall, and they call me the Trick Master. Aha, glad to meet you. You. You come challenge my trick house, haven't you? That's why you're here, isn't it? Yes, it is. Consider your challenge accepted. Challenge accepted, mofo. Enter the scroll there and let your challenge commence. I shall be waiting in the back. Okay. So I actually did this on my Nuzlocke, my Ruby Nuzlocke. I'm like that I haven't done in like a while. I'll hack and slash my way to victory. And uh, right off the bat, I can tell that the layout is way different. Way different than uh. Hey, Sally, I have a villager on Animal Crossing named Sally. Oh, shoot. That's the wrong mon. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm just going to take this episode. Oh, my God, you suck balls. So, I'm going to be taking this episode to go through the trick house. I'm faster than an Oddish, even though I'm paralyzed. What the hell? Oh, whatever. You have got to be kidding me. If third time to try, if, the, if, if it happens for a third time, I'm actually going to raid. Don't do it for a third time. Thank you. Jesus prefers me. <laughs> I don't know. Hey. Why are you so serious? Because I, I have to win. I'll never get tired of hacking and slashing. I see. I remember there was this Minecraft mod called uh, Hack and Slash. I played it a bit. Back, back, back like when I guess it was like really popular, I guess. Like back in like 2013, maybe 14. Uh, this leads to like nowhere. Um. It's basically like Minecraft, but like a JRPG-ish. Like there's like classes, there's things, there's new enemies, there's blasphemy. Um, I don't really know what else. Um, there's that weird creeper snake thing. Who's the trick master? I don't know. I don't know who the trick master is. I think his name is uh Porky Minch. Can't believe I legitimately remembered Porky's last name. Reggie, give us mother three, please. 
Oh, wait. I can't say that anymore. Well, I actually never said Reggie give us mother three. It was just like, I guess it was like kind of like a meme or something. Like, Reggie give us mother three because, I don't know. I mean, like, I guess in a way, I did seem like a post where, like, if they do localize mother three, that, uh, they might, like, take out, like, a bunch of, like, uh, dark stuff in Mother 3 that was in, like, the red, like, in the localization that was in, like, the regular Mother 3, like, uh, I'm gonna dive into some spoilers, but I have played the game twice on my channel. So, um, uh, Mother 3, uh, it, it's kind of dark. Um, right in Chapter 1, Flint's wife just kicks the bucket, gets murdered. There's, like, mild swearing. There's, like, death. And a bunch of other, like, weird dark blasphemy. And, uh... And, like, I think if they, uh, localize Mother 3, they might, like, take that out and, like, make it, like, you know, not dark. Like, I guess how Earthbound's, like, not really that dark until, like, the end. When you fight Gaius. Yes. Because, like, the game has, like, because Earthbound at the start... So like near the, the near the end, it's just like oh happy shit, and then later the, the last part of Earthbound just like dark as balls. I'm just like holy fuck. Is my brother humming outside my room. I was taking a nap. All right, so this appears to be shorter of an episode. I might have to do something else to make the episode a bit longer. I got orange mail. Oh, we need to get the harbor mail in order to get the case. I think I'm doing, I think I'm re of, uh, redoing fire red on my channel. Uh, would you guys be interested in me doing fire red again? Hey. I wonder if this weird. How did you get stuck behind, behind in, a, in a room that is concealed by two trees? I'm glad that HMs are no longer, uh, mandatory to get into the game. I mean, I like HMs. But in Gen 7 and 8, they're just like, okay, we'll just give you items to be able to say fuck you to the HMs. I miss surfing on a Pokemon, though. Maybe Generation 9 they'll bring back HMs, I don't fucking know. Alright, and this should be the end of uh, Trick House number one. I mean, unless there's like a second part that is only an emerald, then uh, we'll find out. Trick Master is fabulous. You, you mean he's fashionable? Ah, you made it to me. Mm, you're sharp. Told me all night to plant all those trees. How do trees grow grow that fast? Unless you're planting using bone meal. You're almost my equivalent and greatest by six places. Fine, you've earned this reward. Hey, it's a rare candy. I don't really use these things uh, because I don't think they give like that much EVs. Scrub that smirk, smug smirk from your face. It's much too early to think you've won. I already won already. Sure. All right. I mean, unless there's like a trick house number three that is emerald only, then. Uh, I don't know. I'll just find out real quick. Oh no, he's still there. If he's like that, that means you can proceed. But yeah, proceed. I don't think I don't think it's talked about. Well, I think it probably does get talked about. But I never really talk about it. It's like the uh, sprite differences in uh, diamond, pearl, platinum, and uh, ruby, sapphire, and emerald. Like the third installment's like platinum and emerald. They, uh, they, they, like, give, uh, the characters different, uh, clothing. Like, boy. He wears, like, something different. I think that's actually what he wears in, uh, or as. Or probably just, like, a different mixture of it. I don't know, he doesn't, he doesn't have any gloves. Which seem to turn, like, green when you walk like that. Okay, so we need to buy some harbor mail, and we need to make our way back to, uh, Slateport. Thank you. 
Alrighty, let's do this. Alright, get out of my bike. And since we cleared this way, we can just take a nice little shortcut without running to the trains. Welcome to the candy shop. Don't know if there's because I'm musically inclined. So 2020 is going off to a great start, everyone. Uh, you know, probably ship at World War Three, then Kobe dies, and coronavirus, and a bunch of other weirdness that leads to what is happening right now. Uh, this world is going to hell. If I had a bike, it'd be easy cycle to sleep ports and shopping. I'd be able to buy Harbor Mail. <gasps> Oh, you have Harbor, ma Harbor Mail. Will you trade it for me for a coin case? I'm so happy. Okay, I'll trade you a coin case. I just did this for the completionist's sake. I mean, I can go check it out real quick. I never really did much with the uh, gambling coin system blasphemy in this game. But, you know, let's go ahead and check it out. Sup, what we got here? It's a thousand bucks for coins and for 50, coin 50 coins and 10,000 for 500. Pretty sure that one's Thunderbolt and that one's Flamethrower. I don't really know the other ones. And we get some dolls. Which is good. Do these guys give coins? I remember in Dragon Quest XI, there was like a little uh, gambling system. And I actually had to uh, do a... Can I get... At Please give, uh, change that number to another six, please. Is there anything in that garbage can? Okay, nothing. But there is a gambling system, like a casino place in, uh, Dragon Quest XI. And from one of the, uh, store missions, I had to get this thing. And I don't know how, I just got very lucky. Then I had to do it again, and it was kind of hard as balls. You know, um, we're all healed up. We're looking pretty fresh. Let's go challenge the Winstray family for the hell of it. I mean, we don't really have to, but basically, you f how this goes is that you fight them, you have to fight four of them at once. If you're doing that's luck, good luck. Hello, I take you're a traveler. How is this? Would you like? What do you say to taking on our family of four in a series of Pokemon battles? Sure, why not? That's spirit, I like you. This might take ten minutes, guys. All right, Taylor. Um. Ah. But whatever, we'll get some nice experience. Uh, oh. That's a zigzagoon. Here's a Naga. Also, if you guys want to see me take on the uh, post post game of uh, Pokemon. Crystal clear. Le let me know. Might actually do that anyway. Because <laughs> apparently there's like more stuff to do in that game instead of beat the uh, Super Boss Gold. Like there's the uh, the boring match. There's also like complete the Pokédex, which seems to be a bit of a pain. Apparently there's also like a Super Super Boss. I guess I should have put that at the end of a Pokemon at the end of my finale video. Blah, blah, blah. Hey y'all, I found a pretty strong trainer. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness, aren't you young? You must have quite the train beat my husband though. It's my turn battle now. So it should be pretty easy. Uh -oh. Ah, flame attack. Hey, 
Well, you only have one Pokemon, so... Strong trainer here. This one's really strong. Are you stronger than Mommy? Wow, but I'm strong too. Really, honestly. Well, you are number three in the list, so... And you have three. This should be easy. Oh, Shroomish. Um... Okay, now this is the part of the video where I have nothing else to like, commentate about other than like, the game. Because I lack commentary experience, even though I've been doing this for like four years now. I should definitely have a lot more commentary. You know what, let's just talk about bullshit. Like, what is... I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. What in my mouth was I say? I keep up level 24 now. Oh yeah. When I get a new mom, I'm gonna have to grind him up. Hey! Did I just lose? Yes, you just lost. It stinks. Grandma! Uh oh. When people call for the grandma, that's not very fun. That I'm gonna be, you're gonna smack me. That's a that's that's like assault, boy. All right, this seems to be a problem. Not really, I could probably just take it out with one shot. Well, you know what? Two shot is better than... Whatever, I guess. I don't know. And that's it! That took a lot less time than I... Assumed. All right, you go inside. They give you a reward. You're the first trainer I've seen who deploys Pokemon so masterfully. But I should tell you, my son's stronger than you. He even took the Pokemon League challenge off you now. I find one of these days. No question how he's strong, but if you were about my grandson. I'm kind of frustrated. Uh, he could be the champion already. Oh God, no. We use this Macho Brace to more effectively strengthen our Pokemon in training. This would be all of us. Here, I don't know if you need it, but we would like to have our Macho Brace. Hey, it's a mark macho brace. Because pump battles would tend to be pretty passionate. So this is a um It promotes growth but reduces speed. Which in my dumbass terms I don't know what that means. But anyway guys, we have just finished fighting Every single trainer we can possibly fight against. So that means in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and take on the um, the third gym leader, Watson, the electric type master. Although there are a lot of other electric type masters out there. So I'm just going to go ahead and switch them out here real quick. And with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Let's Play Pokemon Emerald. Next episode, uh, I already said See ya.